Guys, make sure you subscribe to Cal Culture Radio. Remember, the link will be pinned on top of the chat. Also, the community tab and also in my bio. Remember, we go live each and every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 6 o'clock Eastern Time with my good man Prince Akeem and my good man New Jordan Era. So please make sure you go over there and subscribe. Remember, today we just dropped a dope reaction video um, that you do not want to miss. So go over there and subscribe and all like that. But we appreciate all the new subscribers, all the new viewership. And also the people that come into our lives. We did a dope live yesterday where we talk about um, Rihanna and the ASA Rocky um, photo shoot. So you guys do not, if you, no, sorry. If you guys missed it, you guys want to go back and watch it. That's why the link is pinned on top of the chat. So this one right here pretty much uh, is about Gilly the Kid. Remember, it was, um, it was trending last night. Of course, you know, I'm going to get my rest. So um, Gilly the Kid pretty much... Um, um, did a, a small little live where he talked about the similar fact how women are saying the men. I remember I mentioned that on a previous live stream with um, Prince I King and New Joe and Era, how we live in a generation that, don't get me wrong, women are being attacked on a higher scale and a higher rate. However, there is there is some women out here who are saying the men, so they cannot be upset at what happened to them. So now, Giddy the Kid, he said something about um the women saying the men. Of course, I'm going to play the audio and not the video uh because of you guys already know. So, check it out. Let me give y'all a million dollars worth of game real quick, right? To all the young women out here, all the young ladies out here, don't get caught up in this street shit. You hear me? There's a lot of young women out here dying more than usual. You know why? Because they set niggas up. Facts. They, they, they lining niggas up. Let me tell all you young women out here, once you line a nigga up, once you set a nigga up to get robbed, once you leave that side window open so them niggas can creep into the house, you a street nigga. Yep. Ain't no changing that. Once you jump in that lane, little mama, you a street nigga. So let's stop the dumb shit. There's a lot of young women out here on some dumb shit. Oh, and, and all the rappers tell you in the rap, I got a shorty that's going back door you. I got a girl that's going back door you. Let me tell you something, little mama. That back door will lead to another door, the front door to heaven, when they blaze the shit out you and shoot your fucking wig off. Stop the dumb shit. All right? Not only that, but there's story, there's stories today that talk about the similar fact. Uh, you you can just Google any story from the city of Miami, Atlanta, New York, California, uh, Texas, um, um, in Houston, and um, uh, um, Pennsylvania, and uh, Philadelphia. How there's story that there's women that literally they hold just up to set a man. They would date a guy, knowing they dealing with a gangster, and knowing with the guy pretty much to have money. So these quote unquote high value men looking for the high value women. Some of them are with guys that's ready to set you up. So some of them are working with these guys ready to set you up. So then some of these women get upset at the simple fact of why they're being deleted. Because they, they they hang with guys that um they trying to set up. So these streets the streets don't have love for nobody. They don't have love for me, they don't have love for you, they don't have love for your kids. The streets are the streets. When you under, when you understand the street code and understand you don't want to get into that life, that's pretty much what Gilly the kid is saying. You don't want to get yourself into those lifestyle because when you in yourself when you get yourself into the lifestyle, it's hard to get out. So people like him who's giving you the game and giving um women the game, like, hey, you don't want that life. Just go ahead, live your normal life, go out there, party, focus on your children, focus on your career, focus on your family, focus on your man. Don't focus on these street lights and try to set up men because you're gonna end yourself in a whole lot of mess. Now there's some women that who 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 a whole objective is to set up men, and you saw the 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 demise of that. So, but men are being set up by women each and every day. There's story that's happening in Miami on a daily daily basis where women will literally drug the man um drink, will put um something in the man drink, drug him, take him back to the hotel, and take everything he got. There's all stories like that. Those are incidents like that. And now and now that I think it was a recent story. That have been that transpired in Miami. That situation in Atlanta where uh, I think people already know there was some woman and a man faking like they was getting into an altercation. A man came there to try to be the hero and he got deleted. So that was saying, man, you gotta you gotta you gotta move smart out here. If you see something fishy about that woman, chances are trust your gut and just keep it pushing. Don't try to engage with that woman, don't try to do something try to do something smart, don't try to be heroic. Just keep going and go about your business. Because there's women who 
prime object to be set up to set up you. That's what men don't understand. The simple fact when you flawed on Instagram, YouTube, and uh, and on Facebook, you know you flogging and also Twitter. Are you showing like, oh, you got all this money? Women are paying attention to that, so they're like, okay, how can I rob you? Men seem to not understand. That's why when men say, oh, I'm earning six figures, okay, you try to do that to get clout from the woman, but that same woman you're trying to get clout for is the same woman that's going to set you up. You got to be careful. This is a whole different world we're living in today. A very, very whole different world. So, you know, and I, you know, I'm a strong advocate for, um, I think women should be protected at all costs. However, there is a group of women that I am not advocating for. That they just the scum of the earth like some of these men are. So, I don't advocate for all women. That's a some. Some. I'm talking about that good girl down the street. I'm not talking about that scumbag of a woman. That's trying to set up men on a daily, daily basis. And remember, the man could just be a normal guy and get set up. Because he has some form of quote-unquote resources. So she just set him up and take everything he got. So guys, you got to be careful. And also, guys, make sure you subscribe to Cal Culture. Remember, the link been on top of the chat, community tab, and also my bio. We're going live each and every Monday, Wednesday, Friday, 6 o'clock Eastern Time. Hope to see you there. Thank you for all the new subscribers. Thank you for um, all the new viewers. We really, really do appreciate it. Hope to see you at one of the live streams. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.